We all have pain. We all have sorrow. Caitlin is very talented and she's a student leader. She's always helping me out in the classroom. She is always showing tons of skills in her field in painting, drawing. She does all of those things really, really well. She's done those things since she was in seventh grade. I've known her and I've loved being her teacher and I've loved um, being part of her education at City Academy. Caitlin is a very good writer. She writes um, beautiful creative writing. She writes really great essays. I see her going very far in, in um, English, in writing, and I would love to see her in the Honors English classes in the next couple of years. Um, I'm always amazed at how helpful she is with other students, how kind she is, how willing she is to go above and beyond in her work. Um, I think she has a lot of potential and I'm excited to see where she goes. It was summer, you know, the sunset was going down. We were just kicking it, you know, just being <laughs> us, getting food. What movie did we watch? Uh, did we even watch a movie? No, <laughs> we didn't. No, we did, but yeah. it was what movie did we watch? Oh, uh, everything, everything. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. It was yeah, fun because yeah, yeah. we're all together. We're just uh -huh. all laughing. It's, yeah. it's always great when we're all just together. Like, it's, like, like we're, we're always cracking yeah. jokes. Always. Yeah. Uh, we're annoying. <laughs> Me? Wait! No! <laughs> Love you guys. <laughs> Honestly, I think yeah. it, I feel like we're all we all have our yeah, yeah, we, we all, all have our own man. Everybody's just like all that. Caitlyn. To be honest, Caitlyn. To be honest, Caitlyn. Now we all bet. We all bet. Who's Caitlyn? <laughs> Uh, she's super caring. That's two words. <laughs> she's so scary. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Lily. Smart. Casey. Aesthetic. Yariksa. Beautiful. Mane. Encouraging. Yes. Yeah. Uh, dance. Yes. Dance with a bunch of girls. I don't know. Yeah. Have a, have a fun time. Great. Awesome. <laughs> she's just awesome. She's just cool. <laughs> she's a cool girl. In fourth grade, yeah, we were best friends. We were, I don't know, we were close for like two days, and then he had he got friends, and then I got friends. So it was just we just kind of split, but we were always still close. And then one of those days, I was tickling her during class, and she farted, and she blamed it on me because everyone heard it. I did not fart. <laughs> it was not me. She farted. I poked her stomach and it was just a loud fart. And then it stunk up the whole room. And okay, then she yeah. Blamed, she blamed it on me. And I went home crying. Yeah, it was. It, I was not expecting that. I mean, I was, but I was like holding that fart in like all day. Oh. I did my job. I did my job. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if she is. Or not. I'm saying, no. I I love her. She's my cousin. I don't know. I just, I just have a lot of love for her. Um, I know Caitlin through school, and we have lots of classes together. Um, I know her through school too. I met her in fourth grade. I've known Caitlin since seventh grade, and um, we've been through junior high together. Sassy. Um, caring, because she's sick. 
whenever there's a problem with me, she like asks me about it and talks to me and helps me through it. Yes. Yeah, definitely. I've been, she's been talking about this since like last year. Super excited for her and um, to see her grow up and um, to see how far we've gotten as friends. I think Caitlin, she's a great person. She's very inspiring. Um, she's always making me laugh and we always have fun together. Um, happy birthday and you deserve um, the best of the best. Yeah. Um, I just want to thank you for <laughs> everything you've done for me. Um, be, ha having this be our last year together is really going to break my heart. It's going to be tough. Um, I'm really happy that I met you, Caitlin, and that we're friends, and that you've been there for me, and I've been there for you, and through everything we've been through, I love you with all my heart. Happy birthday. <laughs> Hi Caitlin, I just want to wish you a happy birthday on your special day. I know you've been waiting for this day for a very long time and I'm very happy to be your mother and happy to give you the quinceanera of your dreams. So, uh, we love you very much and we hope you enjoy your day. Hi Caitlin, how you doing? I hope you're enjoying your day. Happy birthday. You know, I'm glad this day finally came. We've been waiting on it for a long time, so now, you know, I hope you're you're having fun. We uh, put a lot of work into this, so hopefully you enjoy this and, you know, it makes good memories for the rest of your life. Um, just wanted to say, you know, I'm very proud of you for doing what you do and, and you know, the way you respect people and you respect yourself. And I really appreciate that. You know, you're, I'm, I'm proud to be your, your stepdad. I couldn't ask for a better stepdaughter. So, you know, that's good. And um, I love you very much. You know, sometimes I'm sorry. It may seem like I don't because I have other things on my mind or I'm busy doing something else. But, you know, I'm always there for you. Um, whatever you want, need, you know, you can ask me. You know, I'll do, I'll go out of my way to help you out in any way. You know, um, you've been a really good sister to, to Christian and I appreciate that um, so you know I just want you to enjoy this day I hope you remember it for the rest of your life and uh, hopefully next time you're wearing a dress you know it'll be on your wedding day and um, one of these days you know you'll know how it feels to be grown up and uh, having your own responsibilities and uh, I like the way you are you're preparing yourself for that you know, you're getting a job and all that, uh, really help yourself out, you know? So, thank you very much for being you, and uh, have a happy birthday, enjoy your night.
Okay.